Republicans are putting illegal immigration and border issues at the center of many of their ads this election cycle. One recent joint ad from Tim Sheehy's campaign and the National Republican Senatorial Committee seeks to tie Senator John Tester to Kamala Harris and to what they call radical policies. John Tester voted to give taxpayer-funded health care to illegal immigrants. MTN is partnering with the nonpartisan website PolitiFact to fact-check campaign ads like these. While this ad doesn't cite a specific vote, Lewis Jacobson, a chief correspondent with PolitiFact, says Sheehy's campaign is referencing an amendment to a budget bill back in 2013. This specific vote from 2013, uh, a colleague of mine, um, a few days before I heard this one, did a fact check and found a similar result that was used against um, Senator Sherrod Brown, who's a Democrat in Ohio. Tester voted against an unsuccessful amendment proposed by Republican Senator Jeff Sessions that called for prohibiting illegal immigrants from qualifying for federally subsidized health care programs. But Jacobson says existing law already said people in the U.S. illegally weren't able to claim those benefits, and it would have taken a separate bill to change that. PolitiFact ruled the ad's claim was false. Jacobson says this amendment is an example of a process called a votorama, in which lawmakers vote on a long series of proposed amendments to a budget bill, often focusing on controversial subjects. What both parties try to do is to get the other party to do something embarrassing, to, to, to sort of force them to take a vote that can be used as a campaign fodder, campaign attack ad fodder. John Tester votes like a radical Democrat. The federal government says immigrants must still be legally present to apply for Medicaid, CHIP, or health care through the Affordable Care Act marketplace. A spokesperson for Tester's campaign said in a statement to MTN, quote, Tim Sheehy and his out-of-state billionaire backers have to try to turn John Tester into something he's not because they can't beat who he is. You can find all of our Truth Be Told stories on our MTN websites, including one from yesterday focused on an ad from Tester criticizing Tim Sheehy's stance on abortion. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.